าแล้วจัดเต็มไปสวัสดีทุกคนสวัสดีคนที่ดูอยู่ด้วยนะฮะกับผมเพื่อกี้ออนะฮะกับเกมเอาแอตซินครีกโอทิซี่นี่ก็อะไรแล้วล่ะหลายวันละหลังจากที่อะไรนะเมื่อตัดเต็มคราวที่แล้วฮะเราเจอเล่นไปมาเจอพวกละทิคาออสคาออฟคอสมอสนะพูดง่ายคือถ้าจะเจอนี่ก็ต้องทำเควสไปเรื่อยๆปลดล็อกถ้าได้ตามเรื่องๆผมไม่เจอไม่เจอแน่ๆใช่ไหมใช่ไหมนี่เราพูดกับใครเดียพูดกับใครเดียโอเคเรามาทำภารกิจต่อครับด้วยกับเทดิสเทดิสเซสที่สบาตันแคมวิ่งมาโดโดโดโดแล้วเอยู่ไหนวะโอ้สองร้อยเมตรทำเสือข้างบนมีสิ่งโตจำได้ไม่รู้จะฆ่ามันไปเพื่ออะไรได้ตังค์เหรอยังมากก็ได้แค่หนังสัตว์น่าจะมีเควสที่เกี่ยวข้องกับมันบ้างนะมีแค่นิดๆหน่อยๆนั่นนั่นแบบนี้วิจอ Many brothers were lost to the Athenian dogs, but we are still here. The battle of the 300. Leonidas was lucky to have that many men. Today we honor the fallen. Today we send our enemies to Hades. Kira will fight and die for her people. We will do the same. We don't go home until these islands are ours. Vilos called. Sparta answered. <laughs> A fine speech. Athenians give speeches. Spartans give orders. Left, left, left. We left, left, left. Let's give that, left, left. If I was under your command, what would you order me to do? Same thing I order my men: bruised, bloody, or broken. Never hold back. Never hold back. I never hold back. I can tell. I wasn't talking about fighting. I know, and I'm tempted. But. But I sailed here for Kira. She's the one I fight for. For now. Well, if you're going to win these islands for her, you'll need more soldiers. They'd never get here alive. The Athenian navy is too powerful, and our ship is at the bottom of the sea. Mine isn't. You'd confront them in open waters. Not sure if you're brave or just mad. The Adresti and I have faced greater challenges than a few Athenian ships. You fight like Achilles reborn, 
but even you couldn't defeat the entire navy. But if I sink enough ships, the Spartans can get through. There's something else. A helmet was left on board my ship. It was my butters. I'll sink the ships, but I'm not making any promises about the helmet. You've been here long enough. How many ships protect Delos? You'll never sink them all. We just need to punch a hole in their patrols, enough to send them scrambling. So the helmet from your butter means a lot to you? It does. He prided from his butter on the battlefield of Thermopylae. The sea's a big place. Where did your ship sink, exactly? Somewhere off the northern coast of Mykonos. We could see Miltiadis' fort as we swam to shore. The sharks will have full bellies when I'm done. Oh, I'm going to take a look at the three of them. Now... I'm going to take a look at the three of them. I'm going to take a look at the three of them. มีท่าเรือไหมอาคันดาคู่ไม่เคยปฏิเสธใครไม่เชื่อมาโอ้โหพูมาทีเดือบายเอาไม้ขึ้นเลยเทนน้ำลำ Let's set sail! Commander! We've been waiting for you! Ready to shoot! We've reached full speed! Speed up! Full power! Come 
Run! ด้วยนะลูกน้องไม่ได้ขึ้นเรือหูเฮาก็เสียใจกันแหละ Let's go Come on ควรเปลี่ยนอะไรแถวนี้อีกแล้วไอ้Fishermen telling tales of the Adrestia cutting through the sea. The Athenian navy is scrambling. Ah! Let their blood feed the sharks. Don't thank me yet. Your father's helmet is gone. I can't even remember his face anymore. That helmet was all I had left of him. But you broke the navy. That will be my vengeance. You have heart, but your troops are your family now. The Athenians will want to kill all of us for what I've done. Then we need to strike first. Exactly. If that's the plan, we attack their commanders. Athenians are sheep. Kill the shepherd, and the flock will flee. March on them, and they'll see you coming. I work better alone. I'll take care of these commanders. You're going straight for their throats. Still, leave some Athenian blood for me. I need to know where to find them. Kira's spies tracked all three of them. One guards the quarry, one's camped nearby. And the third? Him, we don't know. I want names, Thaletas. This Andros commands the Athenian elite guard. Polemion is their strategist. And the last, a general named Neoclis. Is missing. When the commanders are dead and more Spartans arrive, there will be plenty of blood for both of us. Okay, now we can start up the boy. The best thing is. The poor guy jam you here. Ha 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 ha. ไปไปค่าพาราพาราคิกแล้วนี่มันคืออะไรพวกนี้ผมอยู่ใกล้ๆกันแล้วครับทายผู้วาจาก่อนน่ารับทานมากเ
hiding in plain sight. ไปไปเcouldn't save you, soldier.
โอ้โหหนีไปนู่นโอดากิสฉันก็เราไปหาแกแล้วโอดากิสได้ประมาณนี้แหละเป็นเท้าเฉยเลยกำลังนอนอยู่
ของให้โดเพียบจางมันจะอยู่แถวนี้นี่วะ
ให้ทำไงได้ยามาไปหมดแล้วไอ้ดีดไอ้ดีดฟอร์ดีกลอรีออฟดีลอสยูอักต์ดัลโลนและยูเอ็นตายอัลโลนยูวิลสติลยูร์ฮ่าบอกมาเปิดไ
้ในผู้วายกลางมันอยู่นู่นอยู่ดีประตูบานเลยอันนี้What's with all the whispering? Shh! If the soldiers hear us, they'll kill me. You're the Mystios working for Kira and the rebels, yes? Who's Kira? Yes! A smart question to ask yourself. But secrets are not secret forever, Mystios. I can tell you. If you know something, spit it out! If the soldiers see me, they'll kill me. Apollo knows they already tried. There's a house near the market, been boarded up for ages. Sneaky sneak your way in. We'll talk after. Strange. I should find the house, see what this beggar has to say. Namo M. Paragon. ตรงเกิดเมืองโอ้ดักหน้าดักหลังเลยอันนอตว่าเหลือไว้ข้างหลังเตือนจากโบดาร์กิสเขาจ่ายเงินให้ผู้หญิงให้ About what? Bloody footprints. A child's. Must have been hiding in that chest. This woman was killed. Left in the open without dignity. Huh. An Athenian spear tip broke off in her ribs. Wooden dolls, a mother and child, one engraved with the letter M and the other K. Nothing else to find here. I need to speak with that strange woman. And what did the Mystios find? A body, a woman. She was killed by an Athenian spear. This is all? There was a letter from Podarkis. Said he'd kill them both if she broke her silence. Both? Why kill a child unless... Oh, it was his. Shh! They could be listening. Now tell me, quietly, what else did you find? The dolls. Engraved with the letters K and M. M is for mother. You asked who I worked for. The little doll with the K? The child was Kira. Yes, yes, which means... อันนี้คือพ่อของเขาใช่ไหมล่ะ By the gods, Podarkis is Kira's father. 
Very wise, Miss Theos. Very wise indeed. Kira needs to know. She'll never believe you. Never. Her whole life she hunts the man who sent Athenians to kill her mother in front of her terrified eyes. But the gods spared little Kira. She escaped. How do you know so much? I was there, Miss Theos. I protected the little one. The Athenians were so busy trying to kill me, Kira slipped right past their blades. You were involved in this. My name was Otonia. I was a servant for Protarchus. What? Night after night, Kira's mother came to the house. Little one wanted to meet her pater. Podarkis made me send her away, but she kept coming. So Podarkis sent me to her house with a note. The warning. She didn't listen. Podarkis sent me back to her house, this time with Athenian soldiers. Kira needs to know Podarkis is her father. But I won't confront her until I have proof. The woman came to Podarkis' house one night, begged me to give him the doll Kira made for him. If Podarkis had it, he might have kept it somewhere. Only the gods would know. I will find this doll. Now the Mistyos knows who she works for. The rebels should know too. If Podarkis hid that doll somewhere in his house, I'm going to find it. There's the doll. They'll keep a sharp watch here. doll Kira made for him. She engraved it with a letter P for Pater. Could Kira have known all along? The rebels deserve the truth as well. But blood is everything to some people. They could abandon her if they knew Podarkis was her father. A fellow mercenary, are you? มาฆ่าเสร็จแล้วตอนรู้เรื่องเนี่ยนะเออที่ไหนวะเทอร์สวอลล์ออลเดอะมาร์เบลลิงมิโคโนสคันเซฟยูฟรอมไมสเปียร
I'm looking for Kira. Not here. Gone hunting. Once you're with her, she said. I'm in. Where is she? Praying to the gods for a good hunt. The altar of Artemis, east from here, on the north bit of Tavern Point. Thanks. Some huge wound that won't heal. It turns my stomach. I've been hurt. That's why he's Where's Kira? She's. Miss me already, Mistios? Kira, there's something I need to tell you. That look on your face, so serious. Sit, relax, drink some wine. I didn't come to drink wine. I came to tell you and your men... Podarkis is your father. What? Her father? That's a lie! This had better be some joke, Mistios. Impossible! Is it true? The daughter of Podarkis... We trusted you. I trusted you, Cassandra, and you disgraced me in front of my troops. Leave! I can't look at you right now. <laughs> I can't even look at myself. Uh. มาที่ให้อาวุธเ
keen-eyed Artemis, guide my bow. I pray to you with all my heart that Cassandra doesn't scare off the animals with her heavy footsteps. I thought I was being quiet. If that was you being quiet, we'll have nothing but trampled grass to eat for dinner. Nice altar. The flowers remind me of sweeter days. But your real concern should be, how skilled are you with that bow? I've seen you hunt. You don't need my help. Oh, I bet you capture any prey you lock those sharp eyes with. Sounds like a challenge. Come, the Ibex is swift. We're not going to catch any by standing and chatting. There's a spot down here where I used to hunt as a young girl. It was hunt or star in those days. <laughs> Same for me. I started by catching and cooking rodents. <laughs> they make a good soup. But look how far you've come. How far we've come. You should feel a little scared now! Cosmos fights for Athens, and so Athens fights for Cosmos. Oh, <laughs> It isn't beautiful. It is. Now show me how you use that bow. This was a great idea. I'm glad you invited me. I'm glad you accepted. You're skilled with a bow, among other things. Icarus the Your Slayer. Your form is perfect. With the bow? That too. Eh, you don't have anything to My people will be well fed, and the gods will have their sacrifice, thanks to you. You're a great hunter. Why did you actually want me here? Don't be naive. There's something between us, even though I know I shouldn't act on it. 
Because you love Thaletas. And I always will. You... but you just said... You've been of great help to me, Cassandra. And for that I'm thankful. There is something between us. But it died when you gave me Pater's doll in front of my people. I should gather the spoils of the hunt and get back to my people. Take some with you. It's as much yours as it is mine. Thanks. But your people need it more than I do. Get me a handsome reward! Ah! <sighs> 
shipping sent some reinforcements soon. Only... Eagle Bearer, my name is Herodianos, second to Thaletas in battle. The dogs of war howl for blood, and thanks to you, Sparta now howls back. Sounds like a lot of howling. Fight with us! Together we'll run our shields through their skulls and spears through their hearts! I'd be honored to fight with Sparta. To battle!
สปาตัสยังวิจิตไหนก็เควสเควสของเราอืมเวซี่มีหนึ่งอันอันนี้สิเร็วแหมเเราจะเจ็บพันเตอร์บดน้ำเม็ดสเปียบกโบโดยดัซินน้ำเม็ดใส่ดัซินน้ำเม็ดก่อนนี่ใส่เพิ่มแล้วดัซินน้ำเม็ดครับสองหมื่นเ
ชอบไหมครับมาหอกใหม I got the note. This fort has seen better days. They should have spent some of that silver on upkeep.
อยู่ตรงนู้นอยู่ตรงนู้นอยู่ตรงนู้นลงทางลงแล้วเราก็โดดของมาทางสะดวกลงสบายมีอะไรจะแค่หาของทานรักน้องโอ้สมบัติรับโดให้หมดทานนี่แหละต
จามที่แต่ว่ามีที่อื่นอีกสิเนี่ยวันนี้เราเคลียร์ไปแล้วยังเวียไม่หมดเหรอยังไม่หมดจริงด้วยเออ
อยู่ข้างล่างอยู่ข้างล่างไหนเอ่ยพวกเขาสบายคุณควรจะสบายที่สุดในโลกนี้เพราะในครั้งแรกที่อาริสไปแล้วประเทศอาริสไม่มีความสุขแต่ที่ไหนคีราไม่ใช่เหมือนกับเธอที่จะได้รับโอกาสในการดื่มกับเพื่อนๆฉันไม่เคยเห็นเธอเซเลบรตกับเพื่อนๆที่เธอรับรู้ในช่วงที่เธอรับรู้ในช่วงที่เธอรับรู้ในช่วงที่เธอรับรู้ในช่วงที่เธอรับรู้ในช่วงที่เธอรับรู้ในช่วงที่เธอรับรู้ในช่วงที่เธอรับรู้ในช่วงที่เธอรับรู้ในช่วงที่ Pray that we're shown the same kindness when our time comes. In the meantime, there is wine to be drunk and tales to be told. Haha! <laughs> Make the tale great. The troops deserve it. Thaletas especially. Indeed he does! He's just up the stairs that way! I've been meaning to tell him how I lost this eye. And the crew? Ready to sail? On your order! But first, let the crew enjoy a drink and a song. You deserve one too. ธุรกิจต่อไปอันนี้ทูเดอร์ลีมเบอร์คุยกับบีลอสครับยังไม่อยู่ไหนแล้วเนี่ยตั้งตั้งงาใช่ไหมโอ้มองไม่เห็นเลยจุดไฟไม่ไฟตาคมกริบเลยเนาะ Go now. 
into the river of black night and embrace the boundless gloom. You shall wander, obscure, even in the house of Hades, flitting among the shadowy dead. I shouldn't have to say goodbye alone. I'm glad I'm not alone. I've wanted to watch him burn for so long. Now that it's happened, I thought I'd feel peace. And what do you feel? I used to feel vengeful. Now, empty. He's gone, but you're still here. The people need you. If you don't protect them, there will be another Podarkis to come and take his place. They don't need me. You made sure none of them would ever trust me again. We all have complicated pasts, Kira. It's nothing to be ashamed of. Your family, your real family, is celebrating tonight in your honor. We're rebels with nothing left to rebel against. That's not much to stack the family on. But it's more than I ever had. You're right. Thank you. What will you do next? Mykonos will need to rebuild. Then that's what we'll do. But not to put it back as it was, not as Pater wanted. We'll make this place a new home for our people to be free. To live good lives. Kira, he's gone. Your rebels are waiting. They're celebrating. <sighs> Let's celebrate with them. Goodbye, Pater. How? Wake up the party. Hello, party. Then I'll keep party. Get ready. Get up. Oh, oh, oh! Oh, oh, oh! Oh, oh, oh! Oh, oh, oh! You look ready to go. Podarkis is gone. Taletas and Kira have their islands, and I have other targets to hit. You are victorious. Not that I ever doubted it. Why not say goodbye? A rousing speech to get the blood flowing. ไปเลยดีกว่าหรือยังไง Let's say goodbye. Sheraton, settle down, settle down. Nasandra has something she'd like to say. คืออะไรนะพวกเราเป็นสุราเดนส์ Today you have your freedom, so celebrate. Let Dionysus fill your cup, and the muses sing your songs. And now, a toast to Cassandra, to victory! A fine speech, though I'm not sure many of these rebels can imagine a free Venus. I think they liked it. Of course, of course! Who wouldn't? I'll round up the crew. See you back at the ship. Bye, Kabla. Say goodbye, Leo. Chow and Long Gun. Why not? Socrates, the rebels are hunting Athenians. What are you doing here? 
I came to teach, as I always do, but don't worry. I sail on a merchant ship set for Attica in the morning. Wise as always. Thanks for coming to see us off. Speaking of being off, Varnavas, are we ready to sail? The crew are in fine spirits, if a little hungover. But the ship is ready. Good. I only wish we weren't leaving Kira and Thaletas alone to rebuild what's been destroyed by the Rebellion. Are any of us truly alone who have our friends and allies beside us? Exactly! Do you remember what you told me when you first set foot on these sands? I said we came here to help people. That's what we set out to do, and that's precisely what you did! They don't call you the mighty Mystios for nothing! <laughs> who calls me that? He does. Now then, it's time we give the crew some orders. Where do we sail to next? Podarchis was only one cultist, Varnavas. Wherever we sail, we will find more of them. And I will kill them all. Stop, Parakit. You're not น่าจะเกลี้ยงไปที่ไหนต่อเนี่ยโลเคชันต้องหาต่อไปอันนี้เราถึงแล้วอารีนาเนาะนั้นเราเริ่มเฟสเฟสหลักเลยไปที่ไหนกันเอ่ยเออที่นี่มีเฟสด้วยที่นี่ก็หมดกุลาแล้วแต่ที่นี่มีเฟสครับเดี๋ยวไปเฟสหลักก่อนฮิปโปคราติสิสคลินิกฮิปโปคราติสโอ้ชื่อโคตรจาไปคุยกับฮิปโปคราติสฮิปโปคราติสคนอะไรชื่อยาวเออชื่อเล็กยากจากคอนกรีตสมัยก่อนนี่เรียกยากมากฮิปโปคราติสเป็นโลกที่ไม่มีความสุขมากนักเลยฮิปโปคราติสควรจะเป็นผู้ที่มีความสุขมากที่สุดเพื่อให้ผู้ที่มีความสุขมากเห็นว
tell Hippocrates that if he doesn't make a public show of respect to the gods, I will raise an army of believers against him. If the doctor can't think of a suitable offering, his head will do. Oh, thank all the gods she's gone. I thought she was going to kill me this time. What's going on? I am Sostratos. Crisis has accused my master Hippocrates of impiety. Is he impious? He believes that beyond praying, people can take their health into their own hands and make themselves well. Fascinating. Can I speak with him? I'm sorry, he isn't here. I need to meet Hippocrates. Is he in Argolis, at least? Yes, but he's gone southeast of Hera's watch to help the sick and injured. Is this his workshop? It's Hippocrates' clinic. Here we study healing, offer treatments, and provide care to anyone who asks. Why not work with the priests in the sanctuary of Asclepios? It's what this region is known for, right? The priests try their best, but their methods are stuck in the past. Hippocrates is researching new cures and treatments. I'll find him. If you're going to meet Hippocrates, could I trouble you with a small errand? Depends what it is. I want you to bring him some equipment. He was in such a hurry, he left it behind. What kind of equipment? They're just medical necessities. Knives and gut for sutures, bandages. Oh, and uh, an enema bag for clearing the bowels. That had better be properly wrapped. I could bring that to Hippocrates. Really? My services don't come free. Here, take this. Hmm. Though perhaps Hippocrates can teach you something about helping those in need when you speak with him. How will I know who I'm looking for? <laughs> Head southeast of Hera's watch, near the cave of Pan. He'll be standing before a long line of sick people. You'll know him by his um, bald spot, though. I wouldn't mention it. No, I don't pay. So many sick people. Can one man help all of them? <laughs> oh, hello. So what has caused this man's condition? An excess of phlegm, Doctor. In the immediate sense, yes. But more importantly, he suffers from neglect. Neglect? Good food, warm clothing, so much could have helped. But since other caretakers assumed his condition was a punishment from the gods, they neglected him. Challenging tradition. You must be Hippocrates. Yes, I'm also very busy. This is important. Where are all these people coming from, anyway? Patients, mercenary. They come from everywhere, but this is mostly overflow from the sanctuary of Asclepios. 
It's been crowded there since the war began. And with crowding comes sickness. I've come from your clinic in Argos. Sostratos asked me to give you this. I knew I forgot some things. Sostratos is a good physician, but a better apprentice there is none. Did you ask him to pay you for this delivery? Of course I did. I'm a Mystios. Ungenerous, but honest at least. What can I call you, Mystios? Cassandra of Sparta. What did you come here for, Cassandra of Sparta? I've been searching for a Spartan woman. What makes you think I would know her? I was told you may have helped her a long time ago. Maybe the priests at the sanctuary of Asclepios can help. They keep detailed records of all who pass through. Please, Hippocrates, I came very far to meet you. As did this patient, and the one before him, and the one before her. My patients need me, but my notes on diseases of the mind were taken. Retrieve them, and I will help you find what you seek. Hurry, this patient doesn't have much time left. According to Sostratos, you don't like people mentioning your... you know. My what? Your hair. Or lack of it. Yes, yes. Make your jokes while walking around like one of Phidias' sculptures come to life. Did Chrysis take your notes? Ah, you've met the priestess. No, not her, but the local military commander. I can't fault his desperation. Those men suffered terribly from battle fatigue. She would have come here a long time ago with an injured baby. Are you sure she would have passed through the sanctuary of Asclepios? I was a young man then. When I encountered a situation beyond my skills, I would send the patient to the sanctuary. And these priests keep records of their patients? Yes, engraved in stone. The elder priest might remember. Where should I look for your notes? Fort Tyrins, not far from here. Perhaps they'll return them, if you ask. Or they could prepare for a new battle. With me. Far be it for me to tell Amistios how to work, but please, for my sake, do not kill needlessly. Enough blood has been shed in this war. What was so interesting about these notes? They were my notes about diseases of the mind, including what the priests call the sacred disease. That's what this patient has. He's losing control of his limbs and throat, sometimes frothing at the mouth. I fear his breathing will stop next. I'll do my best with what you've told me. Good luck. We're depending on you. ใกล้เกินเลยนี่หว่าอ๋อ
Ace's notes are well guarded. Why? The mighty Tyrians. Built by the Cyclopses. Or so the legend goes. Better take a look. What are you doing here? Hippocrates sent me. Your commander stole his notes, and I think you have them. The ones written by the great Hippocrates himself. I'm sorry. They were burned in the last attack. What? You heard me. The medical tent was burned. At least I memorized the notes before we lost them. Now transcribe them when I have time, or when the war subsides. Then you'll have to come with me. A patient Hippocrates is treating will die without your help. I have a patient right here who needs my help. Can't someone else take care of this one? I'm the only doctor here. Now let me work. I'll wait here for you to finish. If I leave, what's stopping you from running away? Thinking like a mercenary. Guess I shouldn't be surprised. Then make yourself useful and bring me my bone forceps. Some idiot or another's always borrowing them. Then you'll come treat Hippocrates' patient? You have my word. I'll go get your bone forceps.
Where's that coming from? I mean... On power. been there. Once I deliver these, we can get back to Hippocrates. These are the forceps he wanted. Huh! <laughs> 
Fate in your own hands. Sail aboard my ship with me. Is this it? You want a half-bed assistant? When I'm done with the surgery, I'll be honored to help Hippocrates. Might be limping for a while, but Apollo willing, they'll make a full recovery. I'll meet you there. Don't be late. Come <laughs> on. 
Hippocrates, how's your patient? You were gone so long, he didn't survive. I'm sorry, Hippocrates. We took more time because this Misios helped me save my own patient. Sometimes science requires tough decisions. If we're finished here, I'll take some time and write down what I remember of your notes, Hippocrates. I'll go see the priests for more information about my mother. Come with me. You've had a busy day. The importance of diet to maintaining one's health cannot be overstated. What good can one apple really do? <laughs> well, taken daily, they can keep the doctor away. But two more serious matters. I know why you're here. You're looking for your mother. You remember her? I was young then. I didn't know how to help. I turned her away. But her look of determination and despair was born into my mind. It has never left me, and it never will. After, I swore to Apollo that I wouldn't turn away another patient, that I'd dedicate my life to the cause. She made an impression on me. Your brave mother did. She would be happy to know that. I sent your mother to the sanctuary of Asclepios. Tell the elder priest a treatment for the sacred disease will soon be available to any patient who needs it. Then he may talk to you. Thank you for everything, Hippocrates. I'll go see him now. Ochlis! Tuto adi konestim!
You ride! I need to talk to him. Oh, yeah, break it. He is. He got out of him. Got to be careful not to get spotted. He's over there. Any higher. Greetings, young one. Come to offer us Clipios a sacrifice? No. But I'm searching for a Spartan mother who may have. The great goddess Ira guides many mothers to the sacred place. Surely I'm too feeble to remember them all. What are these stone slabs for? These are uh, records. We document all who pass through, uh, their illnesses, treatments, so that the glory of Asclepios can be celebrated. Then I don't need your memory. I just need to find the right stone. Um, yes, of course. That's very wise indeed. If only I had the time to help you. Listen, I'm not here to hurt you. I'm just looking for my mother. It's Chrysis. She's got every priest in the sanctuary under her thumb, and she'll squash anyone who feeds information to the eagle bearer. Then don't tell me anything. Just bring me to the stone that can. Follow me then. Quickly. We must be discreet. Lead the way. This way, over here. If anyone is watching, they'll have my head. What kind of sanctuary isn't safe for its priests? Times have changed, little better. <laughs> Ah, I remember this tale, written during the time of the great Elod revolt. You would have been only a child. I don't need the history, just the details. It tells the tale of a woman with worms in her throat. Asclepios took off her head so we could remove them, then reattached it in her sleep. Definitely not the right one. I wonder what Hippocrates would think of these... Treatments. Hippocrates is a fine healer. Showed so much promise. Showed? He's healing the sick right now. He puts too much faith in his hands and not enough in the gods. When it comes to life and death, I prefer hands. Are all the testimonies so outrageous? Writers today, Thucydides, Evripides, the petulant Aristophanes, 
All of them try for realism. But what really inspires is greatness, magic, gods. Huh? Not that way. Hey! Here. Faster, Tutu! Not another step closer, Selzord! I should try to stay out of sight. This one tells the tale of a man with sword wounds. A pack of dogs licked him clean, and Eureka, a man's best friend indeed. This is hopeless. These stories give people hope even better. Well, I'm losing mine. Tell me about Chrysis. A very powerful, dangerous woman. But it was not always so. She was abandoned here as a child. was very strong-willed, and uh, before too long, it was the priests who listened to her. She was loved, but there's an anger in her heart that could not be soothed. So, when her methods turned to madness, anyone who opposed her got... Um, got what? I've already said... And what about this one? Let me guess. It tells the tale of a blind woman who had her eyes licked by snakes. It reads, of Sparta, came here with child, sought pity from the gods. Why is most of it scratched out? Oh, uh, I'm... I'll just tell you. I know this one by heart. The Spartan woman arrived filthy and bleeding from her travels. We cared for her, gave her food, a bath, and she left. Where she went, I do not know. The child could not be saved. Who does know where she went? We've been spotted. Meet me later, near the olive tree of Heracles, at the entrance of the sanctuary. I may have something for you. And what do we have here? A priest and a mercenary out for a friendly stroll? May the gods be with you, Plistos. I was just on my way to the archives when this Mystheus bumped into me. Is that so? And what were you both chatting about so fervently, might I ask? I'm filthy and could use a good bath. The kind priest here was pointing me in the direction of the bathhouse. Um, yes, that's correct. The bathhouse is right over there. Now, if you'll excuse me. The baths are for healing the sick, not for washing the blood off one's hands. Leave. If you're here for your purification bath, you'll have to come back another time. I'm here for information. In that case, you can go straight to Hades. I need to know about a Spartan woman who came through here many years ago. Did that eagle of yours sit in your ears? I'm under strict orders not to talk to any mercenaries. Especially not about Spartan women or injured babies. I never mentioned the baby. Think you're so smart? Many women pass through with babies. Now leave me. I have my own problems to deal with. Maybe I can help you. Snakes! Snakes. They're everywhere. Must have escaped from the Tholos. We keep them for treatments, but they invaded the bathhouse. The snakes killed someone? A patient was purifying himself when they slithered in. Turns out he's terrified of snakes. Fell over dead. Now the snakes have made him their home. What if I took care of your snake problem? 
Would you talk to me then? Oh, most definitely. The purification bath is crucial in the path towards healing. What does taking a bath have to do with healing the sick? Asclepios only visits the dreams of the pure. When the sick arrive, they offer sacrifice, cleanse their bodies in the bathhouse. Only then do we let them rest in the Abaddon, where Asclepios appears and heals them. How did all these snakes get loose? And why are there so many at the sanctuary? Blame Dorios! He's supposed to keep them in the Tholos. Patients with afflictions of the mind are healed by the snakes. Their tongues are like kisses from the gods. I'll clear out these snakes in no time. Icarus could use a good feast. Try not to kill them. Dorios will be furious if his sacred snakes get chopped to bits. Then how am I supposed to deal with them? Snakes are drawn to the bath's heat. Flood them with cold water and they'll slither back to their hole. There's an underground pipe that may help you. I'll take care of your snake problem. Then, you'll tell me what I need to know. That old priest, hiding by the tree. Opening it should flood the bath and get rid of the snakes. And? Is the bathhouse free of snakes? Now you're going to tell me about the Spartan woman and the baby. <laughs> I actually don't know anything. It was before my time. The man who does know is Mithun, but he won't tell you. 
He won't tell anyone anything. <laughs> <laughs> I like your snakes. At least I got a name. Mither. Na pub, no? A case. I'm not sure if it's loved more for its legend or its olives. I thank you for your discretion, Eagle Bearer. Chrysis has many eyes and ears throughout the sanctuary. What else can you tell me about the Spartan woman and child? The woman left the child's blanket behind. We tried to return it, but it was too painful a memory for her. Where did she go? What happened to the child? So, Chrysis was right. You knew the rules, Timoxenos. You will suffer her wrath. Please, Tos. Please. Get behind me, priest. I'll deal with these two. Ready to die! <laughs> <laughs> Hang on. Not you. He's gonna me. I'll get you. Huh. 